Hello everybody and welcome to BrainBot tutorial for version 0.6 beta. Today we're just going to have a quick video tutorial on how to use the giveaway feature and the auction feature of BrainBot. First off, the giveaway. The first thing you're going to want to do is come over to our settings and we're going to set it up by setting what prize we're going to be giving away. It could be anything. Right now we're just going to leave it as test or maybe test prize. The next thing is the keyword. Now this keyword does not require any kind of thing in front of it, but you can put something in front of it like an at sign or a exclamation point or a hashtag if you want. We're going to use an exclamation point and we're going to leave it as test keyword. This next box is your game code. Now this will not be displayed on your stream at all. So don't worry about somebody accidentally getting the game code and running away with it. This is going to be used for the actual giveaway to the person who won. So we're going to put our game code in here. Okay. And here you can make it sub only if you're a partnered streamer. If you uh, want to make it follower only, you can do that as well. You can turn that off if you just want to make it open to everybody. The time watch slider indicates how long a person has to have watched before they can enter the giveaway. You can move it from zero minutes all the way up to one hour. The run time is pretty straightforward. How long do you want this giveaway to run in your channel? You can make it all the way up to 120 minutes and down to five minutes. The raffle button indicates whether or not it's a raffle. A raffle means the people in the audience that are watching have to use your currency to buy a ticket. A ticket for the raffle can cost any from one of your currency all the way up to 100 of your currency. Okay, so let's just do a little test one. We got a couple people in the channel that are lurking and we'll see how this goes. The prize is gonna be a test prize and the keyword is test and the game code is just a bunch of X's. All you need to do to start the giveaway is hit the start button. At any time you would like to stop your giveaway, you can hit the stop now button. If you thought you were going to be streaming for another hour, but actually you have to leave sooner, you can then stop it right now and give the giveaway away. You may also cancel the giveaway if you think that you set it up wrong or you put the keyword in wrong or maybe the game code's wrong, whatever. And you want to cancel, you just hit the red button. Okay, now it's picked a winner. The winner now has one minute to type in exclamation point claim in the channel for the winner to have claimed the prize. If they don't, within one minute, it will automatically select another player. Now, Silver Subvert has claimed the prize. The really cool part about this bot is it actually, it allows you to give the key away instantly to the person on their Twitch message page. All you need to do is highlight the key, control C for copy, and hit the person's name. It will open up their message box. You can then paste the key, and then send them the key just like that. So that's how simple it is to do a giveaway here with BrainBot. More functionality will be coming in further releases. Let's look at auctions now. Auctions work very much the same way as a raffle. The difference with an auction versus a normal raffle or a normal giveaway is that the people in the channel can use their currency to outbid each other. Say you're going to be giving away a very expensive prize, maybe a video card. You don't want to be giving that away to just any Joe that just shows up in your channel. You want to make sure that it goes to a person who is devoted to you. So they're probably going to have a lot more currency, the people that are devoted to you. So the way this works is you'll go ahead and put your prize in here. If you're also giving away a game code, you can put that in here as well. You can make it sub only, follower only. You can then set the amount of time, just like in the other one, how long they have watched. This next box, high bid to close time. The way this works is if a person bids and they are the high bidder, they will then set the clock. The clock will then be set to five minutes. After five minutes, if nobody else outbids that person, it will stop the auction. You can move this slider up or down however long you would like it to be between the high bid and the last bid. At the five minute mark, if nobody has bid, the bot will start a countdown saying going once, it'll wait 30 seconds, going twice, wait 30 seconds, and then sold. Once the high bidder has been selected, you can then just send them the key or work out however you want to give them this GTX 970 Superclocked Uber Edition. We hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to discuss with us on our Slack group. Thanks, everybody.